And she uh, went on and got degrees, and she just retired after 30 years as a teacher herself at the LA Unified. And I thought, wow, uh, this is the best of who we are as a, a city, as a county, as a civilization, that you can open up these opportunities to folks uh, to pursue that kind of uh, greed and opportunity. And that's what uh, your presence here represents. Uh, this isn't just self-interest uh, for Homeboy Industries because we have the photovoltaic uh, training program, solar pow uh, power installation training program at the Skill Center, which is one of the most viable ways for folks with a past and with records are able to redirect their lives and to imagine something better. It's one of the very few jobs uh, that employers look at and say, wow, you're so skilled, we're going to ignore the fact that you have a record. And so how many folks have we had, uh, in the last year uh, placed? In the last year, 65. 65 folks have been placed. Through the training at the Skill Center, a center of adult education here in this county, where they learn uh, and are certified nationally uh, to uh, go and really uh, get jobs that are really worth having. So we're extremely proud of almost the whole who runs that. And so uh, I'm hopeful that because of your uh, pressure, in fact, this has already worked, I think, in order to get folks who have the power to change this. Uh, adult education represents just a mere 2% of the entire budget, and yet what it is able to impact in our county in terms of public safety, uh, I'm sure the sheriff agrees with this, otherwise he wouldn't be here today, that somehow you have to offer uh, an exit ramp for folks to uh, move forward and to uh, have a life. And so occasionally it happens, especially in this uh, climate of uh, budget cuts and priority jostling, and maybe there are some things we can't reach, but we can reach out to them and all day long, and a future for uh, folks by way of adult education in this county is exactly what we reach for. So thank you for your presence tonight, and we hope this will be a dialogue uh, and that will answer questions or at least uh, raise the right issues. So thank you for your presence, and I give it over to Jose Osuna.